Welcome to your On TV News Desk. I am here today with a whole bunch of people who uh, decided to come down to the Sioux for the Alguma Fall Festival. Yep. Sharon and Bram and Band, how are you guys doing today? Great, fabulous. I don't even know where to look. There's so many smiling faces surrounding me. I've never had this many people. We're very before. happy to be here, and we've had a wonderful, warm welcome, which we appreciate. I'm glad you enjoyed. So, you guys are celebrating your 40th anniversary. Indeed. Sing along that's, celebration. That's right, since we started singing together. So, have you two uh, been with them the whole time as well, the last 40 years? Uh, only 30 of the 40. Only 30. 40 minus 10, yes. yes. Okay, and yep, so you guys have been 30, you guys have been 40. 40. Yeah. We now, had lives before then, too. <laughs> right, but so we're talking about the, 40, the last 40. 40 years ago. <laughs> but, okay, what has been your all time favorite part about doing this? What are you going to miss the most once you're done? I, I would say the audience is singing with us. Yeah. We love, we love singing with people and we love singing with audiences. And when they sing out full force, we just stand back and go, ain't that great? Bram says, we have the best seats in the house. Aww, it's, that's the best view. It's true, it's absolutely true. And, and when you come on stage, no matter how you're feeling, happy, sad, unwell, whatever, it all goes away because we get so much love from the audience. That's great. What about you two? What are, what is your, what are you going to miss the most? I'm going to miss him. Oh. <laughs> Grant's the new guy. Grant. Oh, him. I thought you were pointing at me. <laughs> well, uh, yeah. Grant's done about 1,300 shows mm -hmm. with the trio, as we used to call them. Now, right. Now mm -hmm. the dynamic duo. Mm -hmm. And I've only done about 1,275, so mm -hmm. I'm, I'm the new guy. Mm -hmm. The new guy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that makes me here, <laughs> but... <laughs> now, <clears throat> now that you are, um, you know, you're coming to an end with your... Uh, career, what's next? Like, what's what is what are the plans for retirement? Well, first of all, we have some very exciting things that are happening in the next few months. We we are recording, have okay. recorded, and are recording three new songs, which, as it happens, Bram can tell you about. Them. I will because they were all three of them written by Joe Hampson, who it was Sharon's late husband. Okay, and among many other things. He was a terrific songwriter, and I thought, these songs haven't seen the proper light of day for a long, long time. Let's get them back out there again. So we have the color song, we have the hug song, and we have one called Talk, Talk about, about Peace. Peace. And we've done all of those, plus a new extended version of Skinnamarine. Oh, and that okay. will that will be joined. That will the new Skinner Marink will be part of will be a book. There's a there will be a book a year from now called Sharon Lois and Bram's Skinner Marink, and it will be a pictured book of song, and it has new lyrics. Okay, which were written by my daughter, Aww. plus the old lyrics which everybody knows and sings and does, and the illustrations are by a wonderful illustrator whose name is Chin Ling. And we're excited about it. It's a book about diversity, about different kinds of people, different places. Kind of modernized it it's, in a lot of ways. Well, we made it universal. Yeah. We made it diverse. And so we're very excited about that. So all of that is happening in the next few months, including the book next That fall. doesn't sound like slowing down at well, all. Well, <laughs> we won't be touring on the road so much. But, but we, you will we still will be putting in kind of the same Absolutely. for sure. Work. Absolutely. Now, are there other, what other, where else are you going on this tour? Well, next next week we're going to go and spend uh, almost a week in British Columbia. Okay. We're going to start in Nanaimo. Nice. And we're going to go to. Oh, cheapers! <laughs> Welcome, Sharon. <laughs> da, 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 da. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> Today in sports. I'll be happy about that. Hey, that's okay. Um, we're talking about, you know what? We'll get that cleaned up, but we were talking about Nanaimo. Yeah. You're going to go out to Nanaimo. We're going to go to Nanaimo, and then we're going to go to New Westminster, which is a suburb of Vancouver. Okay. And then we're going to go to Abbotsford, <laughs> and then we're going to go to Kelowna, and funny. then we're, coming we're home. going to go home. And, <coughs> but, and we should tell you, it, you might be interested to know that in the British Columbia, Vancouver specifically was the scene of many firsts for us. Okay, so the first some time that we there. ever played oh, yeah. away from Ontario was in Vancouver, and it was thrilling. It was a year after our, we made the first record. The second time, the other 
sort of monumental thing for us was playing with a symphony orchestra. And the first time we ever did that, that was also in Vancouver. Mm -hmm. So we have a, a place in a our special heart. special place in your heart for, yes, Vancouver. for Vancouver. And will you two be heading out to Vancouver, too? Indeed we will, oh, along with Steve Heathcote, our, our great drummer. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, but he'll, he'll be there. <laughs> Not he's, all uh, the time? Sometimes he's, he's great, or sometimes he'll be with us. He'll be with us, because <laughs> he's, uh, he's actually going to California with uh, the three tenors, right. mm -hmm. I believe. Yes. Now, you got, have you guys mentioned Sault Ste. Marie before? Yep. It's oh, been yeah. A, um, we're told oh, that, yeah. yes, for sure we have. A but, few times? But I think somebody said it was 1991, or was it 93? 91. About, about that, yeah. It's been a Did while. Did you guys come too? Just this year? No, yeah, probably not. Uh, oh, yeah, for sure. 11. Oh, yeah, of course. I was on course. holidays here four yeah. weeks yeah. ago. Oh, really? I was, yeah. Not new, not my, new to this My wife and I came up to Michigan and crossed here, and I was I was here. On, on and the, so you're performing tomorrow yes. at the yep. Stu Community Theatre Centre. Exactly. From 11 to 1? No, yes. 11 to 12. 11 to 12, okay. Yeah. 11 and to 12, yes, right, and for not sure. a two-hour show. No. One hour. And I hear that there's still tickets available. Yes, a not few. many, but, but hurry and get your tickets so and come out and sing and have fun with us. There's still a chance. So we're going to come back after this short break with Sharon Bram and the band, and we'll talk a little bit more about their career so far. Stay tuned. Good. Welcome back to your On TV News Desk. We're back with Sharon and Bram and the band, and we are all dried up and cleaned up on our desk here. <laughs> so we can... We Sharon's can. been punished. <laughs> <laughs> so now we can move on with the rest of our interview. Now, um, you guys have had quite the time together the last you know, few decades. You've played in every major concert hall in Canada. You've received uh, the highest honor in the country, the Order of Canada. Um, you know, everyone knows the classics, Skinnamarink, uh, She'll Be Coming Around the Mountain. What are you most proud of from your entire career? If you had to pick one thing, I'm going to ask all of you. No pressure. No pressure. <laughs> you um, know, it's from the smallest to the biggest. Sometimes the, the great experience comes with half a dozen kids and sometimes it comes with a, a few thousand audience. Right. You, you just, you never know. You never know when it's going to come at you. So it sounds like bringing joy is the pride, whether it's in a small group or a large group. Yep. And I think what, one of the things we're hearing now as we do this tour, we're meeting a lot of people who grew up on us and yeah. have come back with their children. And when they tell us that they continue to sing our songs with their children, to me that's, that's the best you could hope for. I mean, our goal was to bring music into the lives of our audience for them to have forever. Right. And when they tell us that they're passing it along to their children, that feels like forever. And it's also like you guys get to be a part of that family bonding experience as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. How about for you two? What's been, Grant, what's what's the thing that you're most proud of? Of this? Um, of, the, of all this, this stuff. Jeez, it's, it's, it's just there was no two shows alike. They're all, everyone's different, you know? Some of them are. Good and some of them are bad. <laughs> sometimes you're playing to 100 people, sometimes you're playing to 5,000 people. Yeah. Right? And it's just, you go look out and it's like, wow, 5,000 kids? To see some energy. These are stadiums in the States, playing stadiums. It was incredible. Incredible. How about hmm. you, Kirk? Uh, well, to one specific concert, I mean, we've played so many great venues, you know, Carnegie Hall, the Fox Theaters in the States are fantastic. Mm -hmm. yeah. But uh, we did, I, I play a lot of instruments in the show, yeah. and I'm always just, trying to add another one just for fun. And we did uh, a version of Father Abraham, a song that Bram <laughs> sings. And every time what, so he does a... All this physical of stuff. Lots Silly of, stuff. So I had a table with all sorts of bells and cuckoos and stuff like that. And I played my usual uh, fiddle and, and, and banjo and all that sort of stuff. But also we did a uh, song for the first time I played saxophone, which I do not play. But I <laughs> happened to be, in, right. <laughs> <laughs> to be in a good key. So, uh, and uh, Sharon's husband, Joe, was there. And he was, uh, he was always very complimentary about, about the band. So now, it was really don't nice. forget yeah. that last weekend, as we were finishing our fifth show, <laughs> was the fifth show, I think. Yeah. And we were, I think, we, was it Skinner Rink, right? Yeah. And you turned up on stage. 
Oh. <laughs> yeah, well. Well, yes, actually, for 30 years, we've been trying to surprise the trio. And the it duo, works. And with all done. sorts of gags. Yeah, so he came on like you with toes. bagpipes. Bagpipes. <laughs> wearing and a, and a kilt and sporan. <laughs> and a kilt and sporan and my Roy Orbison sunglasses. So. <laughs> Sounds like you guys have to keep real creative to keep these guys on their... Oh, yeah. It's, well, it's a, a lot, lot of laughing. Laughing is important. You know, important. we are a community of musicians and friends. We have fun together, and we make good music together, and that you couldn't ask for more than that, I think. Now, that kind of brings me to my next question. Um, amongst, you know, the four of you, and before there was, you know, the Lois, fifth. And, of course. Yeah. Um, how do you find a flow creatively to work together so intimately, really, for so long? Well, I, I've made a kind of a rule to myself, and I, sometimes I do and sometimes I don't, but if I can, I try to make everybody on stage laugh about something. Yeah. Keep uh, things light? Yeah, and I never know what it's going to be, and neither do they. And I like that. <laughs> I do too. <laughs> we also are so used to each other that something can happen and we can change on a dime. We have and we're been so together. connected that, I mean, Bram and I can, you know, finish sentences for each other. We, yes, and we the, can. <laughs> <laughs> and the guys, Kirk and, and Grant, know us so well that if somebody t sings an extra verse or something extra, they're right there with us. It's, we're really connected. And I think that's something that comes with performing together for so long. Yes, it does. What do you guys think? What she said. What she said? <laughs> yeah, different every time. You never know. Sometimes a microphone isn't working. You just have to Roll with it. Improvise. Roll the punches. Yeah. I mean, yeah. that's part of the field. Like, it's the same thing here. Sometimes your guest spills everywhere. a glass of water yeah. and you just yeah. want to roll with it, right? Yeah. <laughs> you just want Someone to make it interesting. Someone will come and clean it up. Absolutely. Now, so, okay, so we've talked before. We have you guys performing at the uh, Algoma Fall Festival. You'll be performing tomorrow, October 6th, at the Sioux Community Theatre Centre at 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. and there's still tickets available. Now from what I've found here, the tickets are $20 for an adult, $10 for a child, and they can be purchased at the box office in the Station Mall, so get your tickets if you haven't. I hear there's a few left. And come out and see, it might, it's your last chance really to come and see this uh, iconic group perform. So thank you guys so much for coming. Thank, thank you. And uh, you. you know, making us a part of your legacy and your 40th anniversary, and uh, I'm so excited to see what you guys Are have you to come? come. I mean, I might have to I'm be here, but <laughs> <laughs> really? I'll see what I can do. I'll see what Work I can do. <laughs> no, you can make it. Thank you. Now, um, it's okay to come without kids too. Yeah, but, I mean, <laughs> a lot of people who grew up on us come without kids, or they bring their babies who don't have They're a clue. They're having a clue. <laughs> and because they, they find the neighbor's there. kid and they just bring that kid <laughs> so they can say, you. "Go to a concert." Can I bring my dog? Wow. Oh. He's how my big, kid. How big He'll sing along. How, how big is it? How loud is it? He's mm -hmm. quiet. We have a song. He how much is that doggy in the window? <laughs> yeah. Rags. My dog right. Rags. Yeah, we won't we have many All right. That's all the time we have, guys. But thank you so much for joining us on TV. And we'll be seeing you perform tomorrow. Stay tuned for more news coming up on TV after this.